Plus, the miraculous new anti-aging breakthrough that's not for your face. This is a procedure that has no downtime. Can you imagine what that's going to do to my sex life? Find out if it really works. That's today. But first, which cosmetic surgery went up 109% in the past few years? Guess. Breast augmentation? Yes. Tummy tucks? What? Oh, you're getting closer. Very close. Labioplasty. <laughs> there you go. You had it. <laughs> well, That's not what he meant. I didn't. I mean, he didn't. You had the right answer. What right. Did he mean labioplasty? That's between. He didn't mean you. women are having this cosmetic surgery for their private parts and now there's a way for women to look even younger and feel even better in this area down there without undergoing surgery. So no knife involved and in fact as we speak Dr. Berman is in our procedure room with gynecologist and reconstructive surgeon Dr. Alan Saad who has a patient who's about to have this procedure done and, and explain to us exactly what we're talking about here in terms of this procedure. Thermiva is a beautiful little wand that's smaller than the size of my finger that's very effective and very gentle in producing heat right on the tip and place it deep inside the feminine structures. So this is for internal, external use for Tightening? Yes. The it's, outside it's, inside. It's a um, anti-aging procedure for tightening the external labial structures and for tightening the internal vaginal structures. And at the same time, guess what it does? Give it's you a more youthful feminine. A youthful feminine um, vulval vaginal like area. Like we were in our with, 20s, Grace, or yes, 30s, definitely. hopefully. It stops leaking. It improves texture and tone and moisture and improves the sensitivity in tissues that we treat. So sensitivity and sensation is important. You know, out there, you guys, I, it's fun and it's funny to talk about, and I, you know, I'm all about that, but this really is an important subject that a lot of women struggle with. A, how it looks down there, and B, how it feels down there as we age. Now, Gracie and I here, I thank you so much for coming, are sharing our, our stories here. How old are you, Grace? 58. Okay, so oh my she looks gosh, 38, she looks right? Great. And she wants to feel 38. So tell us why you're why you're here and why you want this procedure. Well, you know, when you get older, you have the problem with incontinence, which I do have. However, I was talking yesterday with Dr. Alan Saad, and he told me about a client who was, because the increased sensitivity, was able to achieve six orgasms in a row. Can you imagine what that's going to do to my sex life? <laughs> sexual sensation, improving urinary control, and also how things look. Are you satisfied with the way it looks down there, or do you feel like you want things lifted and tighter? I like it, shall we say, freshened up. All right. Well, and is it, is it fair to say really quickly, uh, Dr. Allenside, that a procedure like this, this whole idea of tightening up, improving, as opposed to a bigger procedure, formal surgery going under the knife, this seems like it's something that's probably a little more accessible to more women. Is that fair to say? Yes, it's, it's very fair to say that you can go to the gym the same night. You can have sexual relations with your partner the same day. You'll feel the tightness effect the same day. But over three months, the effects are so dramatic. Starting at two weeks, the tissues get softer, firmer, tighter, and the sensitivity that increases in both the G-spot areas and the clitoral areas and just the genital areas are quite amazing. Are you going to be targeting yeah. the G-spot and the O-spot and do. all those areas? And what the, I just want to say how it works. It is radio frequency heat that actually changes the color. In the vagina, is that how it's changing the the soft tissue, the collagen and yes. structure of the support of the vagina? Brand new collagen that's softer with an improved blood softer. flow. It improves the localized blood flow so that there's a lot more moisture produced and the patients are a lot more comfortable. And because of the blood flow, the nerve sensitivity is dramatically improved. Okay, so collagen, blood flow, nerves. And obviously, this is a quick procedure since we're going to be doing it during the show. So we are going to let them get started on the procedure in private. 
And we're going to reveal those results a little later in the show. Coming up next, the doctors demystify vaginal rejuvenation. There are doctors who believe that it's a slippery slope and we shouldn't be sending the message that there's an ideal feminine aesthetic. That's next. These days, it's not just about looking young up here. There's a new procedure that can make you look 20 years younger down there. Dr. Berman's back in our procedure room with all the details that we discussed a little earlier. So Dr. Berman, tell us how things are going. How excited well, she looks. as you can tell, they're going so well with her that now I am ready to be the next subject here. <laughs> I mean, I am so I've been here for the whole thing. She's been such a trooper. Anyways, tell me, what do you think? She has her mirror. We looked. She saw. What do you think? Amazing. Uh, we, I could tell the difference visually when I looked at the photo and checked it out with the mirror. Which we Amazing. Make I'm sold. So I'm next. I think Jen Ashton is after me. Me, then Jen Ashton, and then. I mean, I'm so, you're so, I'm so proud. I'm so excited. We can't wait to hear. I can't wait to get it. Thank you so much. Now, how, wait, how pleasure. much is this procedure? If I'm going to be the third person, how much does it cost and how many treatments are normally required? Well, the procedure costs anywhere from $3,500 to $6,500 for a series of three treatments. And I recommend touch-ups once or twice a year, so you never have to have a mesh, you never have to have any kind of foreign bodies. This can help with your incontinence, your dryness, and And, and you know, tightness. I just want to make a, a serious point here. You know, vaginal rejuvenation surgery or cosmetic labiaplasty is controversial, and there are doctors who believe that it's a slippery slope and we shouldn't be sending the message that there's an ideal feminine aesthetic. I take the opposing view that this is 2015, these are modern times. If you don't like your nose and you want to have a nose job, if you don't like your labia and you want to get that fixed, this is all on your yes, body we and do you have the should right have to the choose. prerogative to do that. So, Absolutely. Well, Grace, Dr. Alonso, thanks for joining us. And uh, Dr. Berman, so shall we bid you uh, adieu? Because I'm happy you're doing this, you're not hosting you... the rest of the show with us. How could I not get it? 3500 or whatever, that's priceless. So we're going to we're gonna have <laughs> on our website, after Dr. Berman gets this done, we're going to interview her <laughs> okay, okay. and share whether or not she's happy with her results at thedoctorstv.com. We'll be right back.